Hello everybody, I'm Dan. I've got a Windows Server 2012 R2 machine here that's starting to run a little low on disk space there. Uh, basically I've got uh, 3.57 gigabytes free of you know my 30 gigabyte drive here on this one here. It's just a virtual machine by the way, that's why it's got such a small drive on there. But um, so if we want to free up some disk space using the good old disk cleanup button, it's not here by default. Um, by default, it doesn't install the cleanup manager there, disk cleanup manager. Uh, so we have to install that here on server 2012. So let's go ahead and do that here. I'll show you guys how to do that today. First thing we're going to do is uh, open up the server manager. Then you should have dashboard highlighted over here. Okay. We're going to click Add Roles and Features, and unfortunately we do, we do have to bloat this up a little bit just to get that one feature, but we want to get all the way down through these little things until we basically we get to Features down here. So we'll just do Next, Installation Type, Role-Based or Feature-Based Installation, that's cool there. Next, Server Selection, yeah, that's this machine right here, Server Roles. We're not going to check anything here, we don't want to do anything there, we're just going to hit Next on that. And then Features, we want to scroll down until we see... Uh, user interfaces, okay? Let's expand that out and you'll see desktop experience and this is what we have to install here. And then it will give a uh, little, you know, message here saying, oh, you cannot install desktop experience unless the following role, uh, role services or features are also installed. So uh, we'll just go ahead and go with that, right? Whatever. If we have to install a whole bunch of stuff to get one tool, so be it. All right, let's go to next and then install. Now, this will require a restart when it's done there, so just FYI, I'm not going to select the automatic one here. So, but I'm going to just go ahead and select install on this here. <clears throat> and the installation should go fairly quick. I think I'll go ahead and pause the video here until it's done installing. Okay, so you can see uh, our installation is complete and it says, you know, a restart pending. You must restart it uh, to finish the installation there. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and close out of that and then I'll restart my server. I'm going to pause the video and pick that back up when that's restarted there. So, of course, if we right click right now and go to properties. You see, we still don't have the disk cleanup button there. Okay. Okay, my server's rebooted, and it chewed up a little bit more of my drive space, of course, installing all that, that bloat there. So, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and right click on this, come down to properties now. So, you can see I got my disk cleanup now. So, I'm going to go ahead and select that there, and let's see what, uh, what, what we can clean up here. Okay, the disk cleanup calculated here, and I'll be able to save 880 megabytes of disk space after uh, after I run this here. So, all in all, yeah, it'll, it'll give me a little further along there. So, I'll just go ahead and select OK, and let it uh, go ahead and do its thing there. So, that is how you get the disk cleanup on server 2012. Probably, well, this is R2 specific, it's probably the same for 2012, just basic one there too. And, Maybe even 2008 R2 as well. So, thanks for watching.